G'day, I'm Matt Davey. I'm here with Jeff. Uh, we've got a hive here that the queen has been dwindling or running out of steam and, and it's had issues with chalk brew. So we're going to requeen it. And in this occasion, we're doing it without a cage. So we're just doing a, a straight introduction. Uh, we've had a look through, removed the queen about four hours ago. And that's the important thing is to make sure the queen has been disposed of uh, for at least a few hours before you, you're adding a new queen into a hive. Those bees in that hive need to know they're queenless, otherwise they'll attack the new queen. So what we do is we take the bees uh, with the new queen. So we've got a couple of frames here from a, a mini nuke and um, made sure the queen's not on this frame. So there's a number of bees on this frame and we'll just shake it into the, the, the one where the old queen was. Um, so they get um, mixed in with the, the old bees and that the scent or the pheromone from the queen uh, gets uh, spread throughout the hive. And we'll have a look and make sure they're not fighting. So we'll shake these in first. Yes, eh? Okay, so we've found the queen, so we know where she is. And we've put that other frame in the hive, so there's a space between the old bees and the new bees. So we know she's on this side, so we'll put it furthest away from the, the rest of the bees. And we'll just put this in. So you'll hear a bit of commotion. It won't be long before they all settle down so they know they've got a queen now. That's pretty much it. We'll shake the rest of the bees from the nuke box into that hive and we can close them up and let them do their thing. <laughs>